Hello everyone, welcome back, welcome back. This is going to be for Scorpio singles. How are you, Scorpio? It's been a long time since I did your singles read. I know, I know. So we're just going to jump into your singles and see what we have for you. Um, for those of you who this resonates with, go ahead and like the video here on the white tee. But if it doesn't resonate, you guys, don't worry about it. It's just a general. It's not a personal. So if you are looking for a personal read, you can hit me up at the scene turret at gmail.com but before doing that there is also the information down below in the description box which is the prices that i do have available for the month of july if you guys are interested we have a first timer that is 55 dollars, but the rest of the prices are down below okay all right so let's see what we have when it comes to i'm trying to find the deck that i want to use today and i'm mostly pulled to all right, so let's just tap into it, okay, and see what we have for you. Singles. What's the energy for singles? Thank you, Holy Spirit. What's going on for singles? going on for singles so I'm definitely seeing like so many things that you want to do that have not yet been accomplished it within your life you know whether it is love or you know it's your career like you definitely want more here or you're still working towards a goal and you feel like you know what you've been working towards this for a long time it's like like i'm just seeing like you're looking f like this is really far from you like you can think about it and you want it and you can taste it but it's just not there so that's the energy that I'm picking up so far. You have the emperor coming out here. This huge form of determination to succeed. Okay. You also have the king of pentacles. The three of swords. Capricorn, Virgo, and Taurus energy. A lot of you might have been coming out of some form of relationship with that energy. I'm seeing some kind of um, disappointment here as well. I feel like you're healing through this. This is severe. This just happened. Or this feels very new to you. It could have happened a while back. And it feels very new for, for you still. You are not healed. This is what I'm hearing. You're kind of like burnt out and tired. But there is a final decision that has been made here. I feel like your angels are also showing up here within the judgment. We have Aries energy. Aries is coming out pretty strong. Aries and Aries. We also have Libra for me as a reader because this justice is all about, well, this judgment is all about justice, right? So Libra energy there. Hmm. Okay, let's see. I feel like you're on your way to success, you know, um, a lot of you need to be patient within yourself. Things are going to align the way it should right now. Everything is slowing up because of the way you're thinking. You're thinking that, you know, everything is just gone past you or through your fingers right here when it comes to love, when it comes to the opportunity. I do feel like a lot of you been with been in a relationship where someone was treating you unfairly or you were in a third party situation with this three of swords energy and this three of wands. This happened uh, some time back but for some reason your heart is still not healed here okay um this could have been an Aries energy that you are involved in and as well as a capricorn virgo taurus energy um 
I'm feeling like this person is going to be returning because I'm seeing this return. Whoever this person was to you is going to be returning very quickly. But they still have things that they're not going to tell you about. I feel like they don't tell you things. They're going to give you some form of message. This is also Saj energy in the eight of um, wands here. Very fast paced, a very dramatic entrance. I feel like they know that you have been waiting for them. Like this is what you want within the Knight of uh, Cups. They feel like they're coming to rescue you. <laughs> no, this person is funny. They feel like they're coming to rescue you. Like. They feel like you need them in their lives, in your life. You think you need them in your life. And the crazy thing about this is that you've been through so much. You've been through so much. So everything that you have been going through is valid. But this person is still like holding a secrets from you. I feel like this person could be stuck in something because I just feel like with this three of wands energy it's like something behind them or they're just stuck in something they can't get to do what they really want to do singles okay so watch out for that energy this is all over in this read but i feel like this is the final shot because the angels have made their decision too within the judgment here it has been made yeah some of you this is your twin flame connection that is coming back i feel like you're going to be happy to see them <laughs> oh my god it's like the, the the things that like the things that they say it's like because i was looking at the nine and they're like oh my god i'm here now everything is going to be okay kind of vibe and you should be happy to see me but yet they're still holding back some things from you but i feel like if the sun being here is like they're right they like it was like that energy like they know you you know like they know that you you are happy they look at you as a sun see but there's something going on here three of wands in reverse the chariot in reverse there's something why this person can't choose you completely like they're asking for another chance but they're confused about where they want to be i feel like there's someone else here behind them they want to rebuild so you guys been together once before confirmation okay and they want to rebuild something with you you have Scorpio energy here you're moving forward so tell me more about this stuff within Scorpio mm. Okay, Scorpio, you have more. You feel like you have more to learn. You feel like this is a cycle. You do want the Ace of Cups with this person. Um, but you're moving towards trying to fix the conflicts that you and this person have going on. Um, but you definitely want the Ace of Cups. But you're feeling like this might not occur. And I just had to clarify what that death card was. Because there's a transformation happening within you. You're not stuck or anything like that. Then we have Scorpio Aries energy here again. So a lot of you are dealing with an Aries moon or Aries sun. You know, I'm seeing Aries, Aries, Aries here. Also, you have Cancer, you have Leo, Gemini energy here as well. So there's a few different um, strong, strong um, arcanas. We have Gemini here as well within the Magician and also Virgo energy as well so keep that in mind for those of you who resonates with that we also have taurus and we have a leo within the wheel of fortune and gemini and aquarius or gemini and scorpio it's sometime ish <laughs> sometime ish all right so let's just see what this is all about here because you are definitely showing me vibes of like really just putting everything in the universe's hands Claiming back your power. You're showing a very powerful um, Scorpio within this read. Singles. You're like you're just not, you know, having anyone take your power again. And I feel like this was something that this person tried to do. Um, is take your power. Try to control you within this. Um, this uh, tower energy in reverse. And now they're realizing that, damn, you are strong. You know? <laughs> and they have to also make a decision 
but I feel like you're moving towards them because you still love them, of course, with this um, Three of Swords energy, even though the Three of Swords is in your heart, you still care about them. But since this person been gone, you guys, you guys have been doing very good when it comes to your life and your dreams and your goals and what you want for yourself. So you've been doing very good with that because I'm seeing a lot of that energy, like you're prospering, like you are overcoming, like you are going towards victory and success. And a lot of you are going to be meeting new people and friendships. This is what I'm also hearing. And you're going to be so, so happy. And why am I getting like these new friends is going to be very protective over you as well so this person needs to get themselves together and approach you very quickly because when these new people come around it's going to be very hard to get a hold of you okay um in with the new out with the old that's what i'm hearing in with the new out with the old so that a lot of you could be um getting rid of old friends as well like you're just change it's a, a dramatic change and a dramatic shift that's what I'm hearing. Okay. So tell me about this. Holy Spirit. What's going on for? Mm, surrender. So you surrender within the magician. You are uh, trusting the universe and trusting the divine. Look at the trees. Look at the blissful energy. You know, you are just in this energy of flow, you know, like everything needs to make sense here. This is what I'm seeing. I feel like you are letting the divine take care of this, letting the divine lead you. This is what I'm picking up here for those of you. Okay, tell me more. Tell me more for Scorpio. <clears throat> complicated oh my god to a swords energy you have a huge decision to make you know i feel like a lot of you didn't i say confusion because this person tends to be very confused within the chariot as well something is telling me that this person is with someone else like this person doesn't know what they want to do confused not seeing clearly rose colored glasses <laughs> um <clears throat> it's like the storm look at the storm in the back you know they can't see i don't know if you guys ever been in salt water but when that hits your face you just cannot see clearly your eyes start to burn um you start to be distracted and the, the the nearest thing or closest or safest thing close to you that's what you linger on right you don't go far away to get to where you want to go you just linger on things that is just safer or nearest to you within this card so i feel like this is what's going on here like this person doesn't have the drive to fight for what they truly want it's like they're going with what's comfortable what's near them what's safe And that's what's making it very confusing because you are a lot you are a lot Scorpio but you know what it's it is what it is it is what it is you're in your power this person has to get themselves together okay that's not your fault regret so they're regretting everything that they have done here missing you they self-sabotage this whole connection they self-sabotage this whole connection, you guys. They did this to themselves. But again, confirmation, they will be coming back. Coming back. They And the funny thing is, they're coming back, right? And I felt like this energy, like I said before, singles, is that this person that betrayed you feels like you need them for some reason like they're that cocky like they're that cocky all right so <laughs> they are funny five of swords energy you guys this is what i'm seeing it's like a gray area here okay <laughs> this relationship for some of you is a karmic lesson because it's saying temptation it's saying like you're eating from this um forbidden tree like this shouldn't have happened in any ways so a lot of you this was someone that been with someone else and you kind of knew that they were with someone else within this energy or this is a friendship that 
um oh my god this was a friendship that was introduced to you from a, a your best friend or a really good friend and you're not talking to that person anymore you kind of like took this friendship and now it's blown up in your face kind of vibe um some kind of karmic lesson here this is what i'm hearing release release moving on you guys I feel like you're not moving on. For some of you, you might be moving on on your own, but I'm feeling like you're moving on, again, within this um, death energy, release energy. The same kind of energy here is like you're moving on, but you're moving on towards, you know, what you want, you know. This Ace of Cups is a delay, but you're moving towards fixing this situation. There's a cycle here. There's a pattern here. I feel like you will feel like this relationship is faded, like you and this person belong together. Like this is the energy that you're going through within the Wheel of Fortune. Like you feel like there's a chance that you and this person can work within the Wheel of Fortune as well. Like there's some good things that are going to be coming towards you and this person when if you stay together. You know, I feel like this person is trying to resolve this as well. Like there's this energy of resolving and you're moving towards this energy yeah in the death it's like you understand what happened but at the same time you're not holding on to it but this is what i have for the singles i hope that it resonates scorpio if it does you know what to do like this video give this video a big thumbs up here on the channel and i will see you guys in your next read bye guys